Hello, and welcome to our spa day. So I'm in the midst of finals week, and I have a bunch of presentations and papers to turn in. So my coping mechanism is to just ignore all of my responsibilities and have a self-care day. Our adventure starts with a steamy shower that I took and finally got the chance to shave my legs because they were starting to scare me. After I got out, I lathered my baby soft skin in some lotion and I lit a bunch of candles to join you in our Serenity Spa Sanctuary. So now that I've introduced us into what we're gonna be doing today, uh, there's no need for that. So let's get our spa on. So I have a couple things planned for us today, but first, let me set the mood a little bit. Is this cool or is this too much? <laughs> is this too much? This is my bathroom, so. Might be. It's fine, nothing's ever too much on this channel. So the first thing that we're gonna start off with is a basic hand mask. They say that the number one giveaway to knowing someone's age is by looking at their neck, and right next to that is by looking at the back of their hands. If the back of their hands are not taken care of, if they don't look young, then you can tell that like someone is a little bit older than they might say they are. It's crazy because you never really think to like take care of the back of your hands. You always think about washing your face, brushing your teeth, exfoliating your face, doing all these masks and stuff, but you forget about your hands. It's a concept and I'm learning. So I've never done a hand mask before, but there's a first time for everything. I'm gonna be using this Restoring Natural Extract Paraben Plus Sulfate Free Oatmeal, Almond, and Honey Hand Treatment. It is good for anti-aging and moisturizing for softer, smoother hands. That's exactly what I'm looking for. I'm gonna leave this on for 10 to 15 minutes, and then while I'm doing that, I'm gonna grab an eye mask that I kept overnight in my fridge and put that on my eyes. People say that it's good to keep your eye products in the fridge to make them cold because when something is cold it acts as like a depuffing agent for your skin this is to soothe and relieve puffy strained and tired eyes my eyes look pretty tired so i think i need this it smells really good Uh -huh. Hi everyone. Don't mind me. I'm just gonna have some me time. <laughs> Can I put this at all? Hey Siri, set a timer for 15 minutes. I legit almost fell asleep. That was incredible. I put my phone on do not disturb and on airplane mode so that absolutely no one can reach me. Nobody have any emergencies for like 30 minutes because this is my me time. So don't contact me. Well, now you can contact me when this video goes up, but right now, don't do it. So next, we're gonna move on to the face. So I'm gonna use this Muddy Body Clay Mask, the Detox Clay Mask. I've had this for literally forever. I'm just gonna put some right here on this plate. So while this dries, I thought that it'd be 
really interesting to do something else <laughs> because I found this at TJ Maxx when I was buying stuff for this video. I found something that is described as for the complete home spa experience. I just couldn't pass it up. It, it would be wrong of me to pass that up. So I bought an inflatable foot bath. Soothe your tired feet in our inflatable foot bath. It is the perfect spot to soak and soften your feet for the home pedicure or Epsom salt treatment. The durable structure won't collapse as you use it and it is easy to empty when done. Let's make a foot bath, I guess. <laughs> To use, open valve and inflate the fill tub walls. Add up to two gallons of warm water, mix in bath or Epsom salt if desired. I guess it's time to take off the socks. That actually does feel really nice. Who knew that this spa day would be so successful? A little update on my face mask. It's pretty much all dry. So I'm gonna let my feet soak for like five more minutes and then I'm gonna wipe this off. And then I have one last thing to do with you before our spa day is sadly over. You can't tell, but I'm smiling. So the last thing that I'm going to be doing today is my nails. I don't even want the camera to focus on that because it's really bad. <laughs> so I'm going to quickly take off my uh, nail polish. I have all my nail polishes in here and I don't know which color I'm feeling. I think I want something like for the spring. This screams spring to me. Spring! Okay, so I'm just going to go with this one. So I finished my nails and they came out really, really pretty. I really like them. So I guess that brings us to the end of our spa day. I had a very relaxing time and I definitely recommend that you guys try this at home for yourselves. It's super important to have a little bit of a self-care moment or make a day out of it if you can. I'm gonna go edit this video and then get some much needed rest. If you like this video, make sure to give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe down below for new videos every single week and make sure to turn on my notifications to be notified every single time I upload. All my social medias are listed down below in the description box. As always, I love you guys very much and I will see you in the next one. Bye! Okay.